So Cobes, Josh, he's gotten into a brand new saga that has just captivated his audience. He has entered a brand new world of winemaking. Something that he's proudly presenting, creating masterpieces of, of a beautiful art, just to, expressing his creativity, his master of the alchemy arts. Already is he a powerful wizard with circles of protection surrounding him and a Quan Chi level of, of destructive potential. It's amazing. That's what, uh, you know, he thinks to himself, but the truth is it's fucking stupid. It's straight up fucking retarded. I have to honestly say, out of all the times I have seen him do shit, this is straight up the most nastiest and disgusting shit. And stupidest. Probably life-threatening. Like, I'm talking botulism. But we'll, but we'll get to that. We'll, we're going to get to that in just a fucking second. So, you all know King Cobra. Cobes. Josh. I call him all sorts of shit. I like calling him Josh, but no one knows his, uh, usually knows that. You know, he's got a history of uh, being drunk, bloated. I'm talking about super bloated. I'm talking about, a, you know, this kind of level bloat. Back from uh, back from 2017, uh, shout outs to the uh, Reddit for King Cobra for def. You know, uh, I definitely did not steal. Please do not report. You know, that's that's 2017. That's a fine bloke right there. That's a, a sign of a healthy boy right there. That's a good boy eating uh, his health, just expanding with magical energies, waiting to implode. That's how powerful he was back in 2017. But now, in 2023, where is he now? He's on his way there. Because two months ago, he was not doing quite well. He was in the red. He was depressed, begging, just straight up. I'm, not, I'm like even saying this as serious. Like, he begs on his streams. He's doing long streams. He's tr drunk with whatever he could find. He's like, I'm... Uh, you know, if my sickos, my trolls, they want to fucking harass me every day. And that's all he's talking about. Just the trolls, fuck them, they're harassing him. Woe is me. And, you know, he doesn't have a job. He likes to call his job winemaking, just making stupid shit. And that's not a job. That's not a job. He's just getting gibs from the government. Just like 200 measly fucking dollars a week. Begging his dad, probably, for money. I don't know if he still does that, but I don't know, it's probably. You know, it's, it's his father, Flint Lind, Clint. I don't know his name, Mr. Lind. You know, it's uh, funny. So he decides, because he's an alcoholic, you know, he's got to get drunk to learn winemaking. He looks it up on Google, just <laughs> wraps it up and says, I'm ready to fucking make this shit. So taking our proud uh, wine-making and alcohol-drinking traditions, he just grabs some yeast, grabs some Mexican fruit punch-level uh, mango bullshit, pours it, leaves it in the closet, opens it up after, like I think, like a fucking week or two. I don't, I don't know how long he was fucking doing this shit. It's supposed to be for a month or more. Just letting you know that. And just chugs it. He just chugs all that shit. And he gets drunk, like plastered. And that's how we got here. So now, after such long begging, is he doing? He's just gotten just worse. The bloating has returned. You can see it right there. He's bloating more on his way back from that most powerful of state. And how bad has it gotten? So, uh, you know, uh, yeah, I was going to show this one off, but uh, I don't think there's a good reason to. You know, there you go. Uh, I got a recipe here for a, a recently made mead. And you can look up the video, too. And uh, it's horrible. It's fucking so fucking horrible. I can't, I can't keep a straight fucking face on it. I can't, I can't keep a straight fucking face, bro. It's terrible. Here, I got the whole ingredients list right behind here. I'll read it off to you. Uh... It's called Cookie Monster Mead. Now, I want you to picture that. When I say it and think about it, I'm thinking about ice cream. You know, Cookie Monster ice cream. You ever had that? It's fucking awesome. So, that's what I thought. But let's read it off to you. The list. Cookie Monster Mead. That's most definitely what's up. Sugar. 
because you need sugar. Filtered water. You got to have that. You got to throw it in right when you're done. Honey from the bottle. Cookies. Full cookies. Now, you gotta, you got to get the cookies. It's Cookie Monster, you fucking fool. So what does what, what he put next? Uh, bananas. You know, you want a fruit taste. <laughs> You want a fucking fruit days. Uh, peppers. Yeah. With, he just dumps peppers with the juice, throws it in there. Why? I don't fucking know why. I guess he just likes spice in his shit. Monster, the energy drink. Two cans. Two fucking cans of Monster Energy Drink. Says it on his vid that we're feeling spooky. And just put that all together. The sugar, the cookies, the pepper, the honey, the bananas, the monster, the filtered water. Throw that all together. You made a fucking cookie monster mead. Your alchemy level has increased and now you are able to make your own potions on the potion crafting table. God, this fucking... They got a straight up, you know what what it is? I don't think he's going to get botulism. When he's making mead, you have a very small chance for botulism. That's a truth. You can look that up. Like, they discuss this on forums and shit. You can't get botulism from mead. It's a small chance. That small chance from a... It, it is cranked up to a maybe with Josh. But I, I don't think he's going to die from this. You know, uh, if he just keeps doing this every single fucking day... Without letting it aged. Because he doesn't age this shit. He just leaves it there for a week and drinks it. Because he needs to get drunk. That's what that's what he does. That's what he fucking does. But what the, what the troll should do. If they're worried. They should notify his fucking dad. That's what they should do. And tell him about what his son's doing. Just show him the, send him the, the whole video of him making this slop. And you know what's going to happen? He's going to be pissed. He's going to call his son like, and, and he's going to be like, yo, dude, what's up, dude? And he's going to be fucking mad. He's going to tell him, yo, you better not drink any of that, any more of that disgusting shit. You better fucking stop. Because he's still, he's still babysitting this guy. Sure, he's living at home. That's something, it, well, I mean, in his own home. That's good. But he's still babysitting this kid. Like, you show him that, and he's going to be so fucking mad at the trolls. He's going to be like, the fucking trolls just notified my fucking dad. I can't make wine anymore. He's threat. My, my dad's threatening me, saying I'm not going to get any more money from him if I keep drinking. Fuck the trolls and haters. He's going to be fucking mad. And when he gets nothing to drink, he's going to get even more fucking pissed, depressed, and angry. And it's going to get just so funny. Then when you start doing more annoying, repetitive shit like DoorDash or calling the police... He's going to flip the fuck out and have a breakdown. He's just going to have a breakdown. And that'll be good for not just the trolls, but him. Because he's, he's got to stop drinking. He's on his way to like getting like some bad shit. He's already balding. He's just shaving everything on his face. It's, it's like a fun fact, and uh, something you should know is I had long hair. If you just shave the entire top of your head and just make it short... After having long hair, like, it just shocks your hair follicles. Like, if you have super long hair, that's just not supposed to happen to you. Like, you don't have a, a normal-ass hair that you usually have. It can just choke out your hair follicles, I'm just saying. You know, so he's getting bald. He's getting ugly. He's getting there. So, uh, yeah, you know, that's uh, definitely what's up, dude. Nothing really else to say. He's the wine master. Uh, we'll end by uh, showing him, uh, just showing this one more time. You know, uh, look at our little man. Look at that. That's what's definitely what is fucking up. Dudes.